Hey guys, I'm back with another YouTube video, and today I'm going to be reacting to Oklahoma State's uh, being banned from um, the postseason for NCAA. And uh, I haven't done one of these sport videos in a long time. Um, I don't really know what to make videos now, but what videos to make now. But anyways, um, so Oklahoma State got banned from the postseason for NCAA violations uncovered in an FBI in investigation. Um, it was by a, uh, it was by their head coach associate, um, uh, what's his name, Lamont Evans. And um, I think he was, it happened back in September, 2017. And he, and um, they're going to be, Banned. There, these are the list of penalties they're going to be. They have to deal with um, three years of probation, a twenty through twenty one postseason ban for the men's basketball team, um, a ten thousand fine plus one percent of the men's basketball program budget, um, a reduction of men's basketball scholarships by a total of three during the twenty twenty through twenty twenty one through twenty twenty two through twenty twenty three academic years a reduction of men's basketball s official visits to 25 during the tw 2018 through 2019 2019 through 20 rolling two-year period and to 18 during the 29 through 20 through 2020 through 21 rolling two-year period um, a prohibition of men's basketball unofficial visits for two weeks during the fall of 2020 and two weeks during the fall of 2021 um, the university also must prohibit unofficial visits for three additional weeks during the fall of 2020, 2021, and slash or 2022. A prohibition of men's basketball telephone recruiting for a once-week period during the 2020 through 2021 academic year. Self-imposed by the university. The university also must prohibit telephone recruiting for six additional weeks during the probation period. A reduction in the number of men's basketball recruiting person days by 12 during the 2019-2020 academic year. Uh, the university also must reduce the number of recruiting persons day by 5 during the 2020-21 academic year. A 10-year show cause order for the former associate head coach during that period. Any NCAA member school employing him must restrict must restrict him from any athletically related duties unless it sh shows cause why the restrictions should not apply a prohibition of the men's basketball staff from um from participating in off campuses alluding from three consecutive days during the summer evolution periods in 2020 so um i got all that from cbssports.com so um yeah that's that's all. Um, hope you guys are having a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys all next time.